brownie chocolate chip cheesecake. That's what I'm making for the holidays. Susan. Today I'm making a brownie chocolate chip cheesecake. It's got a brownie crust and then it's got all that wonderful cheesecake with chocolate chips in the center. It's easy to make. So now I'm going to show you how to do it. So if you like recipes and content like this, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Ring that bell so you can be notified when I upload new videos. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. This all helps my channel to grow. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, first of all, we're gonna get our nine inch spring form pan ready. And I'm just gonna spray the bottom. Set that aside. And now it calls for a nine by 13 inch dish, but anywhere from a from a 19 and a half to 22 ounce pack of brownies. This was all my husband could find. It calls for fudgy brownies. Let's melt chocolate, but it won't matter. And you just make the brownies like you would the directions say on the box for fudgy brownies. So this is two eggs. Spoons of water, and I need half a cup of vegetable. I forgot to get that out. And we just want to mix that till it's blended. I've got my oven heating at 350 degrees. Nothing will leak out when I'm fixing my cheesecake. Alright. And now I will pour this in the bottom of this pan. And to cook this for about 35 minutes or until it's set. I'm going to try it 25. So I'm going to get this in the oven and I'll be back. Alright, it took about 25 minutes. Now it's not completely done, but it's set. So I'm just going to let that sit there. I'm going to cut my oven down to 300 and we're going to mix up the filling. And I think I'm going to move it off of the stove so it'll be just not so much heat coming up from the oven. All right. Get my mixer ready. I've got three eight ounce packages of cream cheese. And to that, I want to add can of sweetened condensed milk. I love cheesecake. It's one of my favorites. Put my 
husband doesn't like it. But I'm thankful my sons do. This is what they ask for for Thanksgiving. This is one of their favorites. And I'm also going to use three eggs. bottom and it is and you just want to stir in a half a cup of mini chocolate chips and we'll pour this on our crust in this pan because I'm going to add water to my pan. That'll help my cheesecake from cracking. All right, we just want to pour that cheesecake batter over there. Now your chocolate chips may sink to the bottom. You can put flour, just a little bit of flour to keep them from sinking. But it doesn't bother me if they sink. Alright. Now we just want to Alright. Let me get a Now what I'm going to do is pour set this on my oven rack. Pour some hot water to right about there and let it bake. And I'll see you then. It's got to bake for 50 minutes or until set. It has to bake for 50 minutes or until set. So I'll see you then. And I just wanted to let you know that that's another reason why I put the foil on the bottom so that the water won't seep up to your crust. I just took it out of the oven. It took about 45 minutes. See it's firm, it's not jiggly. And we're gonna just let it sit here and cool. And when it gets when it's totally cooled down, we'll put it in the refrigerator overnight. All right, I'll see you then. Well, here's the cheesecake. Doesn't that look good? Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. And until next time, bye, y'all.